is a guy so positive, though, like you? I've never met anything this positive. Think of sticking a gun in your mouth. It was depression. It was not. It but was sudden. Not only it depression. must have been sudden. You never had depression yeah. before well, in your no, life. Yeah, yeah, it was sudden. I mean, first of all, I was in, they had me on drugs, which I didn't realize until later when they put me on those drugs that week that the first thing the drug does, it makes you more depressed before it, right. before your body right, right. acclimates to it. So I think that was part of it. Two, I was still in shock. And three, as I told you before, not only was Nicole cold dead, they are going to arrest me. That was humiliating. It's humiliating things that are going to come and yeah, arrest me. Yeah, I know. Me. You, Did you go like you, this? You never make up your mind. You just take the gun just, and get in the car. You know what? Car. My thing was, I took the gun when I left my house. As the week went on, I got depressed. And I was in so much pain. I don't know if you've ever been in a lot of pain I have or been something. In a lot of pain. You just wanted the end. You just want to stop it. And I couldn't sleep, and they were giving me sleeping pills, and I had, and it was just like, hey. What were you thinking about? I don't know. All the way down there, I was actually calm. This is the scariest <laughs> thing that could possibly happen uh, as a great guy, this great athlete that just learned how to knock down everything in his path, no. suddenly has a, a hit, a hit, a second, where they lost control. Our biggest fear in life, the reason I can't get in an airplane, is our loss of control. You know what I'm saying? And you represent it. Maybe there's a blip in your mind where you didn't know what you were doing. Your dream? I was in jail for 16 months. Most of my dreams were in a sexual nature. <laughs> a little sexual overtones. It was horrible too, because they didn't change the sheets for like once a week or something. It was the worst. You know, I, whether you did it or didn't do it, but if your one of your kids was murdered, wouldn't you want everything you could get? I would want the person in jail, that's for sure. Yeah. I would want to make their and if life. If you couldn't have that, would you say I'll take the money? Well, I, 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 may, I may be a little different than some people. What you know? would you want? I told you before, to me, there is a way that, you know, uh, everybody's capable of committing murder. Everybody's <laughs> if, capable. If if someone, something happened in your, in your family. Uh, Goldman, I, you know, I felt a long time ago that with Goldman, he don't care at this point. If, if, the, if, if there was a chance tomorrow to catch the real murders, he don't want to catch them because then, you know, then all of a sudden his income is cut off. He ain't going to be making any money. All of a sudden, you really think he doesn't oh. want to find the real murderer? At this point, no. You really at this believe point, that? I think he is. He is satisfied with the way things are at this point. 